Hey everybody, happy Thanksgiving. It's Brian from Pickleball Warriors. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, we're coming to you for this week from Paris Island, South Carolina. It's the Marine Corps Recruit Depot base and my daughter and her husband are both assigned to at the moment. Uh, our daughter is a corpsman and her husband is a drill sergeant here. And uh, I just want to give a big shout out to them and all of our service members out there. Thank you for your service and sacrifice. Especially this time of year, you know, the holidays, a lot of them don't get to go home. Uh, fortunately, we were able to come and visit them and spend some time together. And we are loving it, seeing them and hanging out, playing games and doing a little bit of pickleball. I want to do another reminder. Uh, the deadline is coming up for the paddle giveaway contest. If you remember, look back at my last video. I'll put a link below here. Check it out. Uh, we did a mystery box from Pickleball Central and then uh, took one of those paddles as well as one of the paddles that uh, Pickleball Journeys donated for the cause to put up for a double paddle giveaway. Uh, and all you have to do is like the video and send us an email with a donation that you made to a food bank or a homeless shelter. And it's any, any amount on $5 or more $5 will get you one entry, $20 will get you three entries, and then if you do $100, I'll give you 10 entries uh, into the contest. So please follow up on that, share with others, uh, especially maybe some of those out there that maybe haven't bought them, themselves a new paddle in a while or they need to upgrade and they don't know what to do. Um, it's just, I mean, it's a great package. I mean, those two paddles together, probably close to $500 value. Um, so really, really excited about this. Thank you to everyone who has responded so far. This is a great uh, response, uh, especially you know for the, the shelters and the food banks that are benefiting from those donations. Uh, I know every year is always tough. They're always feeding more and more families and helping more and more people who are just having a hard time. So uh, in the spirit of giving, please join in with us on this and uh, I receive nothing from this. I mean, I, I paid for the mystery box out of my own pocket. I don't want anything in return. I just want to try and share and pay it forward to others. So um, so today's video, I'm going to look at some footage from an old game uh, we got together earlier this year in February. We had a, just a beautiful sunny day one day and one of our friends has a court in his backyard and he invited us to come over and play that afternoon. And uh, so take a look at this footage. I'm going to point out a few things that I see. Uh, some observations, if you will, on, and maybe some things that might help you in your game or might help you think about how to do better in your game. So check it out with us. And again, uh, to everybody, thank you so much for watching these videos and giving feedback. Uh, happy Thanksgiving to you and your family. I hope you have a very safe and happy holiday. Thanks. All right, guys. So like I said, this is uh, outside at my friend Matt's house. And needless to say, we haven't played outside in a while. And... I did not serve well this day. I missed like three or four serves in a row here. So let's take a look and see how these guys do. Okay, here we go. So on this next one, they serve the ball. And after the return, I slide really far into the middle, which that's not really a good tactic. If you'll watch and see, the right side or my right side is wide open and they could have scored on me easily at that point. So one thing I would say is try and avoid leaving that space open on your right side. All right, on this next play, it's a really good example of why the short game is so important. The serve comes up, we get the return back, and a really easy setup for the next couple of shots, and then Matt gets a chance to do a dink, which would have really been easy to continue the point, maybe even win the point, and he put it right in the net. Very important, guys. Practice your short games. All right, on this next one, just the opposite happened. Uh, sent the, the ball back and did a quick speed up to Phil, who then puts it in the net. So again, practice that short game, because that should have been an easy one to continue the point. And, and there we go again, me missing another easy serve. Got to practice those serves. On this point, guys, this is a good uh, example of us moving together as a team, sliding with my partner where the ball's going trying to cover the court just right, and then you'll see Phil hits it between us too hard and goes out of bounds. For this one, guys, this is an example of take your time. They hit that ball, and Bill, on his return, just did not take his time with it, and it skyrocketed right out of the play. So hurry up and slow down when you do your returns. On this one, guys, uh, I like it a lot, not just because I scored the point, but because it's got a lot of good aspects. Uh, it's got a good serve. It's got a good deep return and then a good drop back, 
And then I just moved right up and made the, the kill shot and Phil was not able to return it. So a lot of good mechanics there. Okay, guys, on this next play, this is a, another good set of mechanics. Good deep serve, a deep return, and then Matt's going to do a, a drive on the third shot. And on the fifth shot, I do a drop, which just dribbles over the net, and Bill is able to scoop it up, but he pops it up, and then I'm able to just slam it away. And bam, there that goes. But then, wait, Phil's not done. He calls me on a kitchen violation, says I stepped into the kitchen after reviewing the video a few times, I did not. I think he saw a shadow there. But it was a fun rec game, and we just moved on. So, such is life. All right, everybody. So I hope you've enjoyed the review of these clips uh, today, some gameplay. It's always fun to be able to go back later and watch them and see some mistakes or improvements you could make. Um, obviously, this was a fun game for us, being outside the first time for the season. We actually won this game and uh, had a great time that day and can't wait to do it again with you guys. But uh, take some time and shoot some footage of your games and then go back and watch them later on and you'll learn things about your play that you may never have realized uh, without having somebody review them with you or if you have a coach or something. But uh, anyway, hope you guys all have a happy Thanksgiving again and thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and like us and share it with your friends. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody.